hello friends welcome to the selenium tutorial website in the previous session we saw how to convert a selenium script into java through the selenium ide now you all must be wondering now we have converted the script into java but how to execute it so the answer is for executing a java converted selenium script we require java software in our systems we require a java editor for example eclipse and finally we require the selenium web driver driver jar files so in this tutorial i'll show you how to download java and in my subsequent tutorials i'll show you how to set up eclipse and the selenium web driver so let's start so if you want if you you want to install java in your systems you have to go to this website it is a standard website where you'll find your java software that is oracle.com and tech network java java ic downloads index.html here you could see this thing java download so i'll click here and start my download i will select accept license agreement and you have to select the appropriate option for example i am using a 32 bit windows system so i would be selecting windows x86 if somebody is using a 64 bit windows system then they should select the windows x64 download so in my case i would be selecting this download by clicking on this link given over here so once your download gets completed you will find this kind of an executable file in your download folder here you could see jdk 8u 25 windows 1586 this is the executable file what next what we have to do is just double click on this and start the installation the installation is quite simple you have to just click on next another next and you could see that the installation is in progress this may take few minutes so at this point it is asking us the location where we want to install the java software i am not changing the location if you want to install this software on any other location you may do so but i am just clicking next So as you can see installation of java has been completed i'll just click this close button over here now we have to check whether java has been successfully installed in our systems so how to do that it's very simple you have to open your command prompt like this and we have installed it in our c drives so we'll go to c drive and I will put a simple command over here java space hyphen version and press enter and since we get this output java version 1.8.0 underscore 25 this is the output which means that java has been successfully installed in our systems so this was the first step for running a selenies converted java script we have it successfully installed java next thing is we would require the eclipse software and finally we would be configuring eclipse with the web driver java files i will be completing these two things in my subsequent tutorials this was the first part which completed how to install java in our system which has been done friends thanks for joining stay tuned next tutorials we'll cover the configuration of eclipse and finally